Hi everyone, I hope you're having a good week. So I brought some things here with me today. I've got glue, I've got laundry detergent, and I've got lotion. Now, these things are pretty normal, kind of boring all by themselves, but they all have different purposes. You wouldn't want to wash your clothes with the glue or try to glue something with the lotion. Now, some of you smart kids out there might recognize these as ingredients for something awesome. Slime. Now, I'm showing you this today because I want to talk about how we can all be different. With different passions, personalities, and gifts. God made all of us different and unique. Now, in 1 Corinthians 12, it says there are different kinds of gifts, but the same Spirit that distributes them. There are different kinds of service, but the same Lord. And there are different kinds of working, but in all of them and in everyone, it is the same God at work. My friends, the Bible tells us that as Christians, we are like a body, that we all have different abilities and gifts for different purposes within the body. That's pretty cool, hey? I know sometimes we can look around and maybe wish we had some talents or some gifts as other people that we see around us. And it makes you think, what if I was thirsty and I had this cup filled with delicious water, mm, but I don't have an elbow. It might be tough to drink the water, hey? Maybe I could put my cup high over my head and pour the water into my mouth. Do you think that will work? Okay, let's try it. Ready? One, two, three. Ah! <laughs> Luckily for me, my cup had yarn in it and not water, but I really needed my elbow, hey? In the Bible, it tells us that we are all a part of the body of Christ. Just like having our own body parts, like elbows, make our body strong and able to do great things, you make your church, family, school, and community stronger and able to do more things just by being part of it. Now, not, of, not all of our body parts do the same job, right? It's the same with people. Each of us have different gifts and abilities that we can share. This slime is so awesome with all of the ingredients and it certainly wouldn't come together like this if we were missing even one ingredient. In the same way, if you were not around with your gifts and talents and passions, the body of Christ wouldn't be the same. I love squishy slime, don't you? So remember my friends, even if your gifts and abilities seem to look different than other people, you are a very important part of your school, church, community, and family. And in your time with God this week, I encourage you to pray and ask Him how He can use you as part of the body. And if you're having trouble recognizing your own gifts, you could ask a friend or a family member to tell you some of the things that they see in you. Now, let's take a minute to pray. God, I thank you so much that you make us a body and I thank you so much that all of my friends at home today have different gifts and abilities and passions within them. God, I pray that you will reveal those things to them uh, in their time with you this week. And God, I thank you that we can all work together to glorify you. In Jesus' name, amen. Bye, guys. Have a great week.